Hi guys, it's Keith. Um, again, I don't know why my bandy camp did not record my voice, so I have to talk over this again. But basically, this video, I'm going to be showing off a little thing, a little project that I've been working on for a while, but I canceled due to um, technical difficulties, and it was just time consuming and all that. So basically, I was making a Five Nights at Freddy's fan game about Fred Bear's diner, or uh, the Fazbear Family Diner, or however you would like to put it. Um, in multimedia fusion, but uh, since uh, technical difficulties and all that jazz, um, I put off the project and eventually just gave up on it. So I'm going to show you um, a little working prototype that I had, and I will show you some other pictures and stuff that I had from it. Um, like I said, this was canceled due to personal issues and or personal problems and technical problems and all that crap. So, I really never had time. Um, I apologize if I sound groggy or whatever. It's like 4 in the morning. Um, so, yeah. I'm going to show you uh, the working little prototype I had here. Um, all I had done was the office. There was no events or anything even implemented yet. Not even the cameras were implemented. Just a simple um, door switch for the vents and or vent and one door. So, the way this game worked was... Um, you would turn on a light at the end of the hallway outside the office, and that would shine a, f a shadow in to see if Freddy was there, because Freddy would be the only animatronic in there. So, um, here we go. I'm just going to get the demo up here. So this is the office. Um, you can see there is a uh, light and door switch. So the light that shines in the hallway and door closed, obviously. And then on the other side, it's supposed to say door, but I accidentally put light, whatever. Um, it was to close a vent that you can kind of see up there. It's very hard to see, I know, but there's a vent up there that you could close. The only two animatronics in this game were going to be a Freddy and the Endoskeleton, which you'll see. But yeah, um, I know I've been making videos, but I've been trying to work on the Five Nights at Freddy's 3, but the game hasn't been released, and you know, all that kind of stuff, so please be patient. Um... Uh, now I'm just going to go through some of the photos of uh, other areas in the game. You may have seen this one already because I uploaded it on my Steam page. Um, so, yeah. Um, I'm just gonna say. So, yeah, this is the main stage with Freddy. Um, there's another one with Freddy looking up at the camera. And there's one with the hinted endoskeleton man out in the main room. And there's the room uh, just with no one in it. Excuse me, in it. Here's the backstage, um, which you can see from that camera there. Kind of hard to see, but in the back left corner there, there's the endoskeleton and the extra Freddy stuff. Um, obviously, the endoskeleton would crawl in a vent located in the back room to get to the office quickly, but he wouldn't be very active. Um, there's a couple of other pictures, and endoskeleton looking up there. And here's a hallway which was located off to the right of that uh, this main room here. It was off to the right there. Um, this is where just the main hall which Freddy would use to get to your office. Your office is located on that far back left door over there. Well, not even door, it's just a doorway. Um, so basically the way this would work is um, Freddy would go to a camera and the light in that area would turn off. So, uh, basically, yeah. So when he was in a corner, there was two cameras in this hallway. One on the one on one end, one on the other. When he was looking at one of them, the light would turn off like that. So you wouldn't be able to see him there. Just to make it kind of creepy, you know. Like that. See, so go back and forth, and there's the lights on and off. Creepy old Freddy. Um, so, yeah, and there's the hallway, and there's some doors. Um main pictures at the office with the lights on and stuff like that. Basically all the stuff that I was working on. Um, so yeah, this was basically the prototype that I had going. You could see Freddy uh, getting closer to the office until he was eventually peeking in the doorway. No, oh, hold on. Where's the peeking one? Uh, here we go. Hit the next button. Freaking there you go. Freddy peeking in the doorway. And then the endoskeleton in the vent on the right there. So basically this was just kind of fun and little project I was working on because all the models in this game were ones that I made. The Freddy and the endo, so...
It was uh, kind of fun to throw together. It was just kind of an idea, because I, I had some concept ideas on how the diner would look. Maybe Scott will show us what it looks like in the third game, who knows. Um, but this is just kind of what I imagined, so giving it kind of a 50s diner look to it, and having the stage up there in the middle of it. But yeah, um, so that's pretty much what I was working on. Um, like I said, sorry, I've been working on much. And here's a couple unused pictures. Um, what did it say? Oh yeah, so basically, if you would like to stay more up to date with me, you can also feel free to follow my Davian art page, which I'll open up here in a second. Um, that way you can keep up to date with model work and progresses and all that kind of stuff. Um, I usually upload um, like model pictures, work in progress pictures, all that kind of jazz, so you can feel free to follow me on Davian Art. You can find the link on my profile or in the description of the video. Um, I'll open it up here in a second. Like I said, I'm recording this after I did the video because I'm an idiot and keep forgetting to turn on the damn audio thing. So here you can see my Davian Art page. Um, like I said, model pictures, all that kind of stuff, some of which I won't upload on Steam, so you can find them on here. Um, my endoskeleton picture you may have already seen on Steam, etc., etc. Um, so yeah, also if you'd like to, um, donations are open for the Five Nights at Freddy's 3 map now. I'm going to do it the same way that I did for the second map, if you donate $10 or more. You can um, have a poster in the map of your of uh, an employee poster. Um, I'm not sure where I'm going to put them because, you know, I'm not completely sure the layout of the Five Nights at Freddy's 3 map yet, but when I figure it out, I'll find a place for them. Um, there will also be a link for that if you want to go donate, and make sure to put your Steam name or, or give me a link to your Steam profile in the comment thingy. When you send the donation, you can put a little comment. Um, just give me your Steam name or link to your Steam, that way I know who to thank and who to put on the picture. And yeah, thanks for watching. I promise I'll have a new video with the map thing as soon as I can get more done. Um, yeah, I'll try to get as much more done as I can. Hopefully Five Nights at Freddy's 3 will be released soon. I don't know what Scott has up his sleeve, but I'm sure there's going to be some kind of spooky secrets. You never know. So yeah, I will see you in the next video, and thank you for watching.